now the third jersey I got for this year's World Cup is this Belgium jersey uh, by Adidas. It's my only Adidas shirt. I usually try to get one jersey from each of the big brands. At least one Nike, at least one Adidas, at least one Puma. Uh, not always succeed, but I'm usually, that's kind of the guideline. For 2014 I have it, for 2010 I have it. Um, I kind of have it for 2006 as well. So there you go. Um, this Belgium jersey is the typical Adidas line with kind of um, old pattern, uh, newly interpreted. Um, they used the 1984 Belgium jersey where this same pattern was on a white background, which has one advantage and one disadvantage. The advantage is you see the pattern a lot better. The disadvantage is, of course, that it kind of um, it doesn't belong to the jersey in, in, in a way. It kind of looks a little bit different. This here is a little bit more unique, but if you pull it, pull it at a distance, the only thing that you really see are the yellow little squares almost yeah so that's the one thing that uh, is a little bit odd um i also find i really i, I love the pattern over over but i think it could have been done better i like that the crest is centered here although i could also have seen that you put the crest on one side and the adidas logo within the red because the red is empty space it is absolutely empty space so there could have been done something more with it or have maybe even the black here and the red in the center to just make it a little bit more interesting. Another thing that I thought is you could make it, although the numbers will be small that they put the number here, but on the other side I have to say the number was below here that they really made it nice to put the match detail here. So the kind of uh, in, in the World Cup it made kind of for a balanced look. Other than that it's a very plain jersey it actually wears quite nicely. It's a typical Adidas uh, fabric. It's not as smooth as the classical Nike fabric, but it is, it, it's a little bit rougher, uh, but it wears nice. I also like that on this one, they really went with the three stripes here down the sides in a darker red tone. In fact, it's almost the same tone that is used for this red here, which is also slightly, slightly darker. Um, therefore, you don't really see them. And that makes this like a, an outstanding Adidas jersey because uh, there's hardly any branding. And that's a rare thing for Adidas. They tried to do this with the club jerseys a few um, seasons ago, but this is the first time I see it on a um, national team jersey. There's also, of course, the same pattern here on the back. Again, um, the red, you don't really see. I think this is the drawback of uh, using one of the national colors as your base and then you have the red here kind of disappearing. That's the one thing I really dislike. Other than that, I think it's a really, really, really nice jersey. Actually, I said it already, I wouldn't mind if this is the full-time look of Belgium. Uh, go with that. Don't mess it, don't make anything overly black or whatever. I think even the white stripe here is not needed. Just uh, maybe exchange the black and the red, make this centered and the pattern is more visible because then this is housed in a red um, diamond and makes it look better. I also like um, if you see the pattern up close it's kind of all vertically striping which kind of makes it fade away. This is uh, a little bit this new interpretation of old looks uh, and of course a mathematician in me would want to see either that this line would also be drawn and this line or to just make it a little bit um, make it symmetric but you know it's always the off diagonal so to speak that is drawn but yeah really nice jersey I think this is the best Adidas home jersey I really like the Mexico away jersey that one I gave a perfect grade uh, this is close to perfect it's just because the arrangement and the coloring could be a little bit redone but other than that great job on that one Adidas I'm very happy to own this one. I hope you liked my view at this Belgium jersey. Give me a thumbs up if you did, subscribe to my channel and I'll talk to you soon. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. If you've already done so, I would like to thank you for your support. It is very much appreciated. Also, check out the accompanying blog at the link provided in the description below and at the end of this video. Thank you for watching and until next time.